to study the reactions of sodium hydroxide with aluminium metal and hydrochloric acid. Materials required We will require dilute hydrochloric acid, sodium hydroxide solution, aluminium metal, red and blue litmus papers, measuring cylinder, test tube, spatula, dropper, a lighted candle and a burner. Procedure Take two pieces of aluminium metal using a spatula and put the aluminium metal to test tube placed in the test tube stand. Take about 5 ml sodium hydroxide solution in a measuring cylinder and pour it into the test tube containing aluminium metal. Observe the effervescence and colorless gas coming out through the test tube mouth from the reaction mixture. Perform the smell test on the gas liberated by fanning the gas gently towards your nose. There will be no smell for the liberated gas. Then conduct a litmus test by bringing the moist blue and red litmus papers to the mouth of the test tube. When gas is liberating, we observe that red litmus stays red itself and blue litmus stays itself. Next, we will perform the combustion test. Heat the test tube using a Bunsen burner and observe the effervescence and colorless gas coming out through the test tube mouth from the reaction mixture. Bring the lighted candle to the mouth of the test tube when the colorless gas is liberating. We observe that the hydrogen gas coming out of the test tube causes the flame to flare up and the mild explosion and popping sound of the flame dips out. Reaction with dilute hydrochloric acid Take 5 ml of dilute sodium hydroxide solution in measuring cylinder and pour it in the test tube and label it as A. Similarly, take 5 ml of dilute sodium hydroxide solution in another test tube and label it as B. Add dilute HCl 2 ml from test tube A dropwise to dilute NaOH contained in test tube B using a measuring cylinder. Shake the mixture slowly. Keep on adding the dilute HCl 3 ml from test tube A to dilute NaOH in test tube B dropwise till the reaction mixture in test tube B becomes neutral to litmus paper. No color change of blue and red litmus when pH of the solution is 7. Touch the test tube and feel the temperature after complete addition of acid. You find it warm.